<laughs> I'm going through caffeine withdrawal or soda withdrawal. <laughs> Good morning, teacher friends. Welcome back to the Adapted Classroom. As always, here's a little bit of circle time. Let me know if you would like to see our full circle time routine. Like, I'm already ready for the weekend. Tomorrow will be Saturday. Saturday oh, will be a Kane. What kind of day will it be? Sunny? Sunny day. Sunny day. Oh, what fun. Oh. Rosie's here today. Rosie's here today. Let's all clap our hands and say, Rosie's here today. one you guys I think it's gonna shoot oh, up go. we're going to put in good job Daniel yeah. Michelle's going to put in Friday fun day. Welcome back to the Adapted Classroom. Today for Fun Friday, we decided to do the Coke and Mento science experiment. It was a great way for us to get outdoors and use some of our core vocabulary. We use our words like put in and we also use our scientific method vocabulary such as ask and predict, experiment, observe, analyze data, hypothesis, conclusion. So the students had fun talking about the experiment and then they also had fun participating and watching the explosion. We also programmed some of the words on our iPads with the Go Talk Now app. Let me go grab that. So as you can see, we uh, programmed the buttons to say Coke, Mentos, put in. So that is what we did. We put the Mentos in the Coke and watched the reaction, the physical reaction. We decided that for next year, we would expand that. We would have each student bring a different type of soda. So Coke, Sprite, orange soda, all the different kinds of sodas. And then we thought we could go to the park next door so we'd have more space and try the experiment there. So ideas for next year, ways to improve. After that, we came inside, we did some sign language. We are incorporating sign language lessons into our day. And then after lunch, 
We went upstairs to music. Music is back. Yay. We did drumming with uh, Mr. B and our Gen Ed peers. And that was really fun for our students as well. And I know I haven't posted videos in two weeks. I have been a little bit busy with life. <laughs> so my middle daughter just turned two. We took her to Goofy's Kitchen. That was a lot of fun. Last weekend, uh, my baby sister, well, let me rewind. My baby sister is getting married. So last weekend, we had a bridal shower for her and she's getting married soon. So um, they've been very, very busy. And then my brother's birthday is also this coming weekend. So many birthdays, so many celebrations, so many things to do. This afternoon, I'm taking my youngest, my son, who is seven months old, to his baby wellness check. So that should be fun. Um, other than that, I don't have anything else planned for this weekend personally. It's just been very crazy for me these past couple of weeks. So sorry that I haven't uploaded anything. I do plan on getting those past Friday fun day videos up though. It might just take me a bit. I also wanted to mention, I also wanted to mention because this video will be going up on Sunday and I know the TPT site-wide sale is going to be Monday and Tuesday, the 28th and the 29th. So I thought I would showcase one of my newer TPT products just so you could get a closer look at it. Um, it's over 400 different picture symbols and different categories for the picture symbols. So I have different subjects and different picture symbols for each subject. So this is calendar. Uh, you see all the different picture supports for that. We have the dates for the calendar. We have the colors, because I know during our circle time, our morning routine, we do colors. We have weather. We have ELA. So these are all the core words and different vocabulary that we use while we're talking about read alouds and anything ELA related. And so when you purchase the a TPT product. All of them will have tabs like this. My little demo doesn't have all the tabs, but the one that is on TPT right now does have the tabs. So this one says ELA and all of the subjects will have tabs on them. And so if you take off the icons, you can see that there's a placeholder, a little home for them. So you can place them back where they belong. So this one says like, this says like on the back, and so the backing, the home where it belongs is printer friendly because it's all black and white. And then um, you have all the icons. So there's ELA. These are just some of the different things that you have in ELA. We have music. There's a library. There's math. There's recess. I'm excited about that one because recess is a wonderful opportunity for our students to interact with their gen ed peers. And it's a great way, it's a great time to bring our AAC devices out and use these uh, picture supports with the AAC devices. We have art and different vocabulary for art. We have cafeteria. So different things you do in the cafeteria, like I want drink, I want more. So um, if you're new to AAC and using picture symbols, there are many ways you can use it. Like I just did, you just model to the student or you can actually show, well model and show them and have them choose icons. There are many different ways to use it. So then there's all different types of cafeteria food for breakfast and for lunch. We have science and then some more science symbols. So each subject has three pages worth of picture symbols. These are missing right now because we use them this afternoon for our activity. Those were the ask, predict, experiment, observe, analyze data, hypothesis, conclusion ones. And then we have social studies. U is missing. We must have used it during one of our lessons. 
Um, and then there are different community items related to social studies and transportation, different landmarks. And then we also have greetings. So good morning, hello, high five, wave, shake hands, elbow bump, fist bump. So those are the different picture icons that are included in this pack. And it's part of a growing bundle, which means that since it's still growing, this is the lowest price that you can ever get it. So I would totally grab it because it's so beneficial. As you can see, we use it in our own classroom uh, and we use it for AAC devices. And it's so wonderful to have them. I use them more during our center times because we have centers for math, ELA, life skills, core words, sensory. So it's great to just have a board to grab and go and use on our AAC devices, everything already prepared and prepped. So along with this bundle, by the end of April, there'll be two more sets of communication boards. These are all communication boards that you can use for school. I'm also going to have a set of communication boards that you can use for the home and for holidays. So that will be the complete bundle. And like I said, uh, because Monday is the TBT site-wide sale, I would totally go ahead and grab it because it's over 400 picture symbols and it'll be the best deal you can get it at. And like I said, you see it in all my videos. We use picture symbols all day, every day in my classroom. I'm such an advocate for AAC and giving our students access to communication. And this is just another way to give our students a chance to communicate and use picture symbols to communicate. I use BoardMaker. I am a licensed seller through BoardMaker. Um, so yeah, it's a wonderful resource. It's something we use in my classroom every day and I'm happy to share it with all of you. All right, friends. So thank you. Look at how thick this is. <laughs> thank you for joining us in the Adapted Classroom. Until next time. Bye. Bye.